Hi, this is a demonstration of Android CRM project. This is a very useful Android based application or Android plus web system as you can say that helps uh, custom relationship that is uh, CRM uh, executives those uh, who work in custom relationship management to handle and manage their clients uh, with ease so their responsibility is to handle the clients have manage them keep uh, talking to them as well as uh, you know try various other options to convert them into leads and provide a proper customer experience to them so for this purpose they need to be in touch with their customers uh, they, they need to keep talking they need to keep uh, you know uh, maintaining the, they need to keep a follow up of those leads so for this purpose uh, this android application is uh, the android part of a web based system so this allows them to manage their leads from their mobile phones they can view their contacts they can uh, you know keep follow ups they can uh, schedule meeting timings as well as follow up timings in this application and uh, so this is the customer this is the user part here this is uh, to be operated by the users or crm executives they can log in from here and use the system so let's see how this works so we'll enter the id and the password of that particular employee and uh, we'll say login and this will send us to the home page or the dashboard uh, of that particular employee where you can see the number of leads which are converted and the leads which are not converted and its amount uh, which he receives uh, from converting that leads and we have uh, upcoming meetings uh, over here where you can see the meetings which are upcoming for the day and you can see the details of that particular meeting uh, which we have entered uh, during adding the meeting uh, so this is the menu that uh, he he gets uh, where he can uh, see all his contacts leads opportunities and search for the companies and all uh, so let's see the context menu uh, so this is the context where he can add his leads by just entering the name mobile number email id company etc and uh, this is and this is the id of that lead which you have to remember and this is uh, auto generated by the system so next we have is a leads menu where you can uh, see all your leads uh, uh, which have entered to the system uh, so the if we select uh, any of these leads you will be sent uh, to the details of that particular leads so let's select this one and you will be sent uh, to this page where you can see the details of that lead uh, like its mobile number email id and all if you select convert uh, the lead will be converted to the next stage and uh, if you select uh, any of these leads over here so if you select any of these leads from this you can see that uh, their details and you have to select uh, the status of that lead if he has converted then select yes and if it's not converted then select no and you can just say update and the database would be updated uh, so you can see the status updated and uh, if you select uh, some other leads uh, you can just select this one and uh, say that this lead was uh, converted uh, so you can just say yes and select update and the lead would be converted uh, to your yes account and uh, let's see the search company module uh, where you can search the companies for uh, fetching some leads and something so you, you have to just enter the name of uh, the area which you are currently presented and you will get the companies uh, which is uh, located in that area and so you can just contact them and do your stuff next here we have is a communication page where you have the details of uh, all the leads uh, which you have in uh, which uh, which are in different stages so you can just select any of them and uh, you will be shown their email id and the phone number so then you can send uh, mail or the sms so if you want to send mail just click on send mail and uh, the mail will be sent to them if you want to send an sms uh, just select sms and uh, send the message uh, to them uh, so this is uh, how you can communicate with that uh, particular lead or something and uh, carry on your procedure Mm. Next, uh, next we have is a add meeting uh, module where you can just uh, fix a meeting with someone uh, and uh, you have to just enter the details like name of the meeting or the name of the person 
it's uh, the date of the meeting time and the note if you want to add something so let's say the name is abc the time is uh, the date is uh, 30 06 and 15 and at uh, 1 pm uh, or 2 pm so i have to write this 14 and the note say i want to have a lunch meeting with him so th this is just a, just a reminder for me and i will say submit and uh, if you go in the dashboard menu you will be shown uh, that this meeting was added to your reminder so you can uh, see this uh, reminder module where uh, you can uh, get the reminder of the particular meeting and you can select de details uh, where you will get the details which you entered uh, during that meeting and if you don't uh, want this meeting or this meeting has been cancelled you can say delete and it will be deleted next we have is edit context uh, where you can edit the details of this context by just searching their id and you can say search and it will be shown the details of that particular lead uh, where you can uh, change its name last name mobile number email id or something and you can update that and the, uh, the leads detail would be updated uh, through that uh, so this is how the app for the employee works now let's see the admin module uh, where admin has a different uh, different setup uh, on online where he can just uh, enter its id and password and you can get the details of that particular uh, employee and all so from here you can he can add uh, employees uh, by just providing the password name dep department mobile number email id and uh, if you enter all these details uh, a mail will be sent to that employee uh, with its id and the password so that he can use that uh, app for him and uh, the details and then click on submit so you can see that employee was added to the database so next uh, let's see the add, uh, company module where you can add the company for uh, the employee to search so you can say uh, excel corp and its uh, address would be similar and uh, you can add that company and uh, as an employee they can search from their mobile application uh, next we have is an edit employee details so you can just edit the employee details by searching its id and say search and you can see that its uh, details are present over here and you can just change uh, anything if you want and say update next is uh, employee records where you can see that uh, how many leads will be converted by that employee and all so you can see that if you select this employee you, you can see the number of uh, leads converted by that particular employee and the amount which he earned by converting that leads uh, so this employee has converted only two so he earns only 400 so next uh, if uh, so next if we select uh, this employee uh, he has converted zero leads so he gets uh, zero amount so this is how the system works thank you